it's your Furo's video. So, I realised this morning that it's been quite a while since I did one, and some people uh, liked uh, my Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes videos. So, I'm going to be doing some more, which is cool. So, I was playing it this morning, and I unlocked the Death Trooper, which is quite a cool character, actually. A uh, really, really, really cool character. He's only two stars, which I think is a bit harsh on him. I've got a load of characters. Here he is. So this is my Death Trooper I just unlocked uh, this morning. Quite an easy character to get, but still, quite cool. So, but today, uh, I'm going to be uh, discussing and uh, talking to you about the 501st Legion team. Now, for those of you who don't, who don't know about Star Wars, back in the Clone Wars, before Darth Vader, etc., there were clones, which were similar to Stormtroopers. Now, because there were so many clones, they were divided into legions, and each Jedi got given a legion. Now, Obi-Wan Kenobi got given the 212th legion. Uh, there is a 212th legion clone in Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. He's called Commander Cody, but he's not uh, what we're going to be doing today. So, Anakin Skywalker, uh, Obi-Wan's apprentice, got given the 501st legion. Now, the 501st Legion, it can be argued, was the most, was the best team you could probably uh, find. Now, in the 501st Legion, there were absolutely amazing characters like Five, Zeko, Rex, Jesse, loads of iconic characters, and they were just so good. So it can actually be argued that uh, it's a really great team all together in the movies and on Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. So I haven't unlocked General Skywalker yet. I've got a normal Anakin Skywalker but he's nowhere near quick enough. So we're just going to be working with Fives, Ahsoka, Echo, ARC Trooper and Rex. Now the leader of this team uh, was normally Rex. Rex was like commander and he was called Captain Rex. Now Rex in in Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes is quite a useful character. You know, he's quite useful. You know what I mean? He can be used uh, to heal, he can be used to get rid of uh, bad effects, and a whole load of other uh, bunch of stuff too. And then Fives, for example, is a very, uh, he's a very, you know what I mean? He's, he's a very willing character. Uh, in, the mo in Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes, he gave uh, his, he gave, in, in Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes, he gives his life to save uh, his friends, which is quite cool too. So, I'm just going to like, uh, upgrade a couple of my, uh, there we go, all done. Right, so now we're going to go hop straight into battle, which is great. You see, the problem with this guy is I have so much like, I have so many honor that it's like, it's so, it's so useful, it's so good and it's so bad at the same time. It's really good. There we go. Oh my god, do I still have more? Uh, I that good. Okay, that, there we go. So finally, that's that done. Now we're going to go into battle and put this to the test. So if we hop into... Let's go to here. Now I'm going to look for a character to use which is related to... Oh yeah, let's just use Anakin. Why not? Why not? There we go. So that's our 501st Legion team. That's literally the complete 501st Legion. So I, I'm finding that pretty cool. So, here we go. Now obviously Anakin has a lot of health because so I borrowed him. So here we go. Okay, so one thing about this team you might notice is it's very it's very good with teamwork. You know what I mean? Because they, when one person attacks, another clone usually attacks too, which is kind of cool and very irritating to play against. Because when you're trying to play against a team like this, where when one character attacks, another attacks, it's kind of frustrating. Like you lose a lot of health very quickly, and as you can see. It's quite cool, quite very fantastic and very, uh, very useful. But it's not very fun to have against you. Uh, one thing about this team is 
it depends who you have as your leader in this team, but if you have Ahsoka as your leader, you get health quite quickly, like, as you can see with that attack, you know, this whole clone team is based on health and tenacity and, you know, keeping good, you know what I mean? Having no negative effects, which is cool too, so, for your attack, so it's like, you know, teamwork. Great stuff, you know what I mean? Because if somebody, if a clone is you you know that another clone will come and attack too. As you can see, the coin is good. Everybody's getting close to the attack. Pretty fantastic. So we're going to finish this off nice and easily with... So, oh, he came back to me. Bounty Hunters. There we go. So... What did you think about AOK Five the first Legion team? Well, to be honest, I don't really use it often, but I like how uh, you know, there's a lot of uh, teamwork and functioning, and it's very useful and takes off a lot of damage. So that's kind of cool in a way. It's very useful to have, but it's not very nice to have against you though, because trust me, even with my strongest team, it's very irritating to play against. So thanks for watching, guys. Let me know in the comment section what team I should do next. Grapes19, I know you're an expert on this game, so you would know. I'm going to try maybe do uh, an attacker team. Uh, because attackers are kind of interesting too, because they take off a lot of damage, but they don't really have anything, you know, they don't have anything useful after that. So, yeah, guys, next time I'll do an attacking team. And, yeah. Let me know in the comments if there's another team you should I should do as well, which would be quite cool too. Uh, if you play this game, then that's great. You would be able to know. Thanks, guys, and isolation out.